What's going on guys, TIE Fighter here, welcome back to their episode of Death Stranding here on the channel, or how I like to call it normally, this is Amazing Fetus. Uh, on the last episode, we escaped Amelie's Beach, um, and uh, we did that by Dead Man getting to us somehow, he's going to explain how he did that, but uh, we figured out that she's an extinction entity, like kind of already knew, and that we were able to stop her for at least right now, so let's see what happens, I guess. I'm kind of nervous, because... I think this is going to be about to be the end of the game. Not what I think it is. Yes. What could be more connected to Amelie's beach than President Strand's umbilical cord? Mm -hmm. Hartman thought that's why she left it with me in the first place. Unfortunately... It didn't work. Yeah, she'd already cut her beach loose. It was just... gone. We didn't know if that meant she dragged you into the great beyond, or sent you to some other beach. We were really racking our brains. Hartman and Mama split up and started searching every beach you might feasibly have washed up on. We looked for a month with absolutely nothing to show for it. Jeez. How long on the outside? How long on the inside? Trust me when I tell you, you don't want to know. <laughs> but don't worry. We found no signs of accelerated aging. In the end, this is what led us to you. Just when we were about to give up, Die Hardman reminded us about the revolver. So we tried to follow it, and it led us to a far corner of your own beach. And bingo, there you were. Mama made visual contact first. She was able to see you from her vantage point on the other side. She informed Lochna via their connection and Hartman confirmed your location during his subsequent NDE. The plan was for Fragile to, in essence, slingshot Lou and me to your position so we could rescue you. But it's not so easy to send multiple individuals to another person's beach for an extended period of time. And that's where the umbilical cord came in. We wove these from President Strand's DNA. Mm. They serve as a single knot that binds us all. The president must have known all of this would happen. Ironic, isn't it? The gun that set this whole mess in motion ends up being the key to saving you. Amelie, hmm. she said it had another purpose. Not a weapon, but a lifeline. A stick that became a rope. Mm. <laughs> I suppose that's one way of putting it. <laughs> oh, Sam. <laughs> you have no idea how long I've been waiting to give you a hug. <laughs> that's funny. Got something else to tell you. Top secret. It's about Cliff. Bibi's mother's name was Lisa Bridges. Cliff's common law wife. What? Lisa Bridges. Uh, uh, now, Cliff was killed by a man identified in the records only as John. Yep, Former John. US Special Forces. Die hard man. Quite good at it by all accounts. Later appointed as an aide to the president, who used him for most of her wet work. The records go on to state that he vanished after Cliff's death. A warrant was put out, but he was later found dead. Turns out some people die harder than others, though. Dear John donned a mask and reappeared with a new identity. But you can't fool the chiral network. We restored the old records, and Mama hid them deep in the archives. You're the only one besides us with access privileges. Take a look if you're so inclined. But don't say I didn't warn you. The president's got some dirty, dirty laundry. Oh, uh-oh. Speaking of which... I don't trust him. But I'll work with him if that's what it takes. We'll talk later. Sam. What up, John? I don't expect you to forgive me. But would you hear me out? 
I killed Captain Clifford Unger. Yep. Makes I sense. You I did it for America. For love of country. But I didn't. I did it for her. Because I loved her with all my heart. She was everything to me. Everything. Now, I'm not trying to make excuses. I just want you to know that not a day's gone by when I haven't thought about it. Time didn't help. Or the mask. Please, let me finish. He... The captain saved my life. You know why they call me Die Hardman. Because he wouldn't let me die. He brought my sorry ass back home every time. And I loved him. As much as I loved her. Mm, sad. <sighs> and when he stared me down, that ghost, I knew he was here to kill me, to make it right. And why shouldn't he? <sighs> why didn't he? He couldn't save his, his kid, his baby. And that's what brought him back. I guess when he, he saw I was trying to do my part for America. He remembered who he was. And he forgave me. God! <laughs> this is so sad. But I don't deserve it, God damn it! It actually wants me, makes, it actually makes you want to cry. It's really there sad. There is no atoning for what I've done. <sighs> like video games have come so far like this is like not even like video games anymore it's just, like a movie and it's so you feel it it's like actual acting and not just like people just walking around and talking it's like actual acting and realism and it hurts so much it's beautiful Maybe this is the next best thing. Maybe he brought me back from the beach for a reason. One last time. He wanted me to do this. To keep on being Die Hardman. No. He didn't. Nobody wants a president who acts like they're immortal. And if you're not scared of death, how can you value life? And life is pretty fucking fragile right now. And yeah, the old ways die hard. But that's what's gonna have to happen if we're gonna come together and build a better America. That gun won't help you here. That's her words, not mine. Oh, jeez. Wow, Sam has changed so much. He's become so wise. Like, that actually was very wise of him to say. Oh. I guess that helped him. It was, it was so sad. The fact that he feels 
horrible that he had to kill him and after everything that Cliff's done for him. Like, that would hurt me too. Like, jeez. Hey, Sam. Been waiting for you. Lou? Oh. Dead? No. Poor thing was never truly alive. Not in this world, at least. What? The decommissioning order finally came through. No! Can't risk necrosis. The body can't stay here. I thought you might want to take care of it. <laughs> no, I'm actually gonna cry now. You could try taking Lou out of the pot just to see what happens. But that would be in direct contravention of an executive order. <sighs> And there are laws about that kind of thing, now that we're a nation. I just couldn't bring myself to do it. But if the alternative is defying the president, I can't do that either. Not me. All right. <sighs> I'll go to the incinerator. I don't know. Please don't do that. <sighs> Before you leave, I'd like to check something quickly. I just took your cufflinks offline. Oh. In that state, there'd be nothing to stop you from removing them. Oh, he's trying to help him. If you did, the UCA wouldn't know where you were or how to find you. You'd be invisible. When you use the incinerator, you'll be reconnected to the network automatically. I trust you'll remember what I said. All right. Absolutely. Oh, Sam. You came over a sphere of, of Affenphosphophobia. And you became a changed man for the better. That's nice. Dude, this game, it just hurts me to my core. I don't want Lou to do that. No, don't bring Lou to the incinerator. Oh, it's fragile. How's the weather? Don't think you'll be needing an umbrella. <laughs> I decided to follow my father's dream after all. Don't worry. I won't get mixed up with any terrorists this time. UCA's got my back. We're the first private delivery company to get the official approval. Sounds like you're moving up in the world. Congratulations. Thanks. Wait, there's something I have to tell you. I didn't shoot Higgs. Oh. Couldn't pull the trigger. Oh, God. So I let him choose. Death or eternal solitude on the beach. Well, fair enough. You never did like breaking things. That's right. I find and fix what's broken. And reconnect. Oh, that's nice. I'm fragile, but not, not that, that fragile. fragile. <laughs> you want to come work for me? Could use a man like you. The world's still broken. The same as before. What isn't? But we're still here. We're still chugging along. Not everyone. Not me. Come on. You put America back together, didn't you? Doesn't mean there's a place for me. 
I've got no ties to anyone or anything. I might as well be dead. I felt like that when we first met in the cave. I still do. Don't act like you're the same person. You've learned how to touch, to feel. You've connected with people. With us. Everything I touch, I lose. Oh, Sam. Sam! Oh. He basically does lose everyone he touches. Oh, he didn't even eat his crypto bio. I'm sad. Come on, Lou. No. One last delivery. Don't do this to me. I'm actually gonna cry. Episode 14, Lou. Oh, God. Oh, my God. No. I actually... I actually have to go to the incinerator. Oh, no. Oh, God. This song is... I've heard this song before. This song is a beautiful. I've heard this song. God. <sighs> like this song right here is one of the most influential video game songs I've ever heard. Definitely one of my favorite video game songs ever made. It's so good. Left waving signs because I'm leaving. This song is beautiful. I'm sorry. Oh my god. It gives me chills every time I hear it. Oh my god. <sighs> it's actually making me cry. Oh my god. This is beautiful. This game has been, like, it definitely, I would say that it's definitely one of my favorite video games ever made, like, oh my god. This game is just amazing, beautiful, everything you ever want. Amazing story, amazing graphics, like amazing music, everything you could want is just in this game. Oh. This song matches with the game so well as well. It's like it was it was made for the game, but still it makes sense that it's in the game. Oh, well, Igor left all this stuff for me. That was the guy that had BB at the start of the game. 
it so makes sense so much now as well because this is where we started the game going to the incinerator and now we're ending the game doing that like oh my god that's such great storytelling Well, here we are. Oh, Sam, don't do it to Lou. No, here we are. <sighs> oh, come on. Sam, don't do it. If you do it, I will actually never forgive you for doing this ever. For the rest of my life, I will never forgive you. I guess we're here. <sighs> Please don't do it. Me, oh. Oh, I didn't notice that they have a little heart on their arm. I didn't notice that. Not in this world, at least. Hmm. Oh. Thanks yeah. for everything. Connect one last time. Oh. One last memory for us. One of a kind. Oh, it's this one again. I do that or a sacrifice. A foundation. Oh. A bridge. Brought you an astronaut. Mankind can go anywhere, even outer space. Oh, so now we're seeing the the You'll be out of memories, there but on the other side. And the second all this is over, I'm going to take you wherever you want to go. Ah. <sighs> Oh, there's Jean. Can I help you? Holy shit. John, is that you? Captain, what are you doing here? My wife's checked in. They don't want a repeat of last year. The void out in Manhattan. <sighs> well, it just makes sense why they knew each other now. Because they were in battle together. I'm so sorry. I didn't know you were the husband. This isn't what we agreed on. You said you'd do everything in your power to save BB. We are. But we cannot release your son just yet. Believe me when I tell you it's for the best. Is this a woman in a mask who's done nothing but lie to me? I have a duty to protect our country. Lies are an unfortunate necessity. <laughs> Little lose watching in the back. The president gave me the highest level access privileges. I've used them to manipulate the security system. We have five minutes before it resets, sir. Hmm. Five minutes to talk. Off the record. Yeah, he was trying to help him escape as well. Help him escape with BB. Take BB and get out of this place. There's nothing I can do for your wife. I'm sorry.
You were my commanding officer, but I swore an oath to the president to protect her and the country at all costs. Now, if she orders me to do something, I have to do it. I have to. But I served under you first. And your family doesn't deserve this. Any of this. Why are you helping me? If they catch you. Because you saved my life, sir. Again and again. When the brass sent us into the jaws of hell, it was you that brought us home. Back then, I thought I was invincible. I thought I was some kind of action hero. But I'm not the hero. You are, sir. You're the reason I'm still alive. And it's past time I paid that debt. They're moving your son to a new facility tomorrow. How? Oh. You'll never so see it. So it is again. a it is a boy. He'll serve as the foundation of a new communications network. A sacrifice for a nation that no longer exists. I wrote down everything you need to know. It was the only way to keep it off the system. Burn it when you're done. The rest is up to you, sir. Oh. <sighs> Now, there's Lisa. She was a she was a still mother of BB or Lou. He's wearing a jacket this time. I believe this belongs to you, sir. Now, I can't terminate your wife's life support from inside her room. System won't allow it. So, this is the only other option. Oh, does he have to kill his wife? Oh, God. Oh, God. No, don't do it. An alarm is set to go off if she flatlines. I've rigged the system to spoof her vitals. But you won't have long. Five minutes, tops. Don't hesitate, sir. This is the only chance you'll get. Sad. Cliff has definitely become one of my favorite characters, and now he's going to have to kill his wife to save his son. Take care of him. I promise you. I promise you. Oh. 
Oh, and they shaved her head. <sighs> now it's the hardest part. I don't. I don't even want to watch this. Oh God. Oh God. I don't want to watch this. No, oh, it's over. Oh, jeez. That is so messed up. I couldn't know. I, like, imagine having to do that. You have to kill your wife. Or your husband or whatever. You have to kill them to save your kid's life. That is just so messed up. Now, now the memory makes sense. Okay. Oh. Oh no. Don't do it now, Sam. You just saw that memory. You can't do it. Come on. Don't do this to me, game. Oh god. Oh, this game is gonna make me go insane. I don't want to do this. Please don't. Can I just get Sam killed so he doesn't have to do this? Come on, please. Oh, I don't do this. Why do I have to cremate BB? No. I just took your cufflinks offline. In that state. There'd be nothing to stop you from removing them. Yeah, can't you just leave? Just take the if cuffs did, off and just run? The UCA wouldn't know where you were or how to find you. You'd be invisible. When you use the incinerator, you'll be reconnected to the network automatically. Oh. You just took the cuffs off. You could try taking Lou out of the pod just to see what happens. But that would be in direct contravention of an executive order. Wait, no. What are you doing? Sam! What are you doing? Don't even think about it. No. Don't do it to me. No, 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 no. Don't do it. No! Sam! What is your freaking... Why? Don't do that. No. Don't do that to me. Why am I getting an awesome for that? I should get like a... a, a angry emoji or something. Come on. Oh, God. Don't do that. I'm actually gonna cry. Don't do this to me. Yes! Oh, my God. Thank you. Sam, thank you. A purpose that cannot fulfill outside the pot. There is a 70% risk of catastrophic failure simply in removing it. Oh. It's another memory. Oh, what? Why am I why am I repatriating inside the the room? Hello? Sam? I'm sorry, what? What is happening? Can I go out here? Oh. Hello? Oh. That's Cliff. What is he doing? Okay. Where am I going? This this way? Oh god, okay, go back, go back, go back, go back towards Cliff. Go back towards Cliff. Don't bring me there. No. Is this how Cliff's gonna die? I just go back to him? Oh. Oh I do. Oh, there we go. Oh. Okay. Oh, the soldiers are going to see him, though, right? Yep. Hey, boys. Nothing to see here. There is no man with a BB here. Don't worry about it. Go mind your own business somewhere else.
He doesn't want you here. He's trying to go save his kid's life, so. Please go away. Oh, it's locked. Dang it. Oh, does he just get trapped in here because he can't leave? That's sad. Yeah, that one's locked too. That's great. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Not good. Not good. Oh god. Okay. Now nah, the system went off. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh god. Oh. Back off. I was using BB as his, as an incentive. Okay. Get up. Oh, Don't that's where it. we got shot. And then John's trying to protect them. I'll handle this. Oh God. Because Jean is the president's aide, so don't want him to get killed. Thanks for trying, John. Oh, that's sad. Step aside, sir, or we'll be forced to open fire. It's a dead end. He's trapped. Security will take it from here. Oh, the heck? Why are why is Sam just in the room now? Oh jeez. Oh, is this how he dies? Oh god. Does he like know where to go now? That's kind of smart. So it locks the door. In here. So can they not see Sam? I didn't see what they can. Bridget, I hear her voice. Oh, great. <sighs> Don't worry. This 
okay. <sighs> oh, I'm actually gonna cry. Oh god. See the sun. No, don't do that. The day is ending. This is so sad. He's just gonna die right there. There's no pretend. I will hold you and protect you from that moment. Oh, jeez. It's so sad. Who's holding Lou when you die? That's terrible. When I found out I was gonna be a father, I was so scared. Scared of what it would mean. Be there for you and your mom. No matter what. I couldn't just go off and get myself killed anymore. Couldn't leave you all alone. I couldn't. Get off of him! Now! <sighs> I had it all wrong. All wrong. Being a father didn't make me scared. It made me brave. I'm sorry. I'm sorry it took me so long. Same mistake. Be yourself. Be free. Oh my God. Oh. Oh. He took them out. Oh no. Captain. I need you. Oh God. To hand it over. Shoot him, John. Oh, Sam's even trying to protect them. Let it go. Please. Oh my shoot God. Him. I'm gonna cry. I gave you an order. Shoot him. You told me your name was Sam Porter. What? Wait. You were saying bridges. He can see me? My son. Oh! My bridge to the future. What? Oh my god. Without you, I was just like. He was the BB. What? Dead end. Forward. I'm so confused. What an obstacle. Looking on at the world people like you were trying to build. Dividing people was the only thing I was ever good at.
So he was. I'm so confused. How is how is he BB? How is he like the BB? Does that mean that's a different one? Oh, it makes sense that it's BB twenty eight, but that's like the first BB, isn't it? So he is the first BB. So this is so heartwarming. Now it makes sense why he was talking to him kinda like that. So that's him? game I did not know that that cliff was Sam's dad that makes so much sense now oh <sighs> and sh oh, she shot him oh she shot Sam that BB too that's why he dies. What? No, 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 no. That's why she said she fired twice that day. Oh God. So that's why she went to his beach. Cause he dies as a, a baby. That makes so much sense. This game is so, it's so well made. Oh my God. I love this game so much. Oh. Oh. Why are there just whales now? I don't remember whales being there before. Oh, there's Cliff. Yep, that's why Sam's there, because he dies. Okay. And then... And then, uh, Amelie, or Slash Bridget, goes there. But why does she just start calling him Sam, though? Because that's not his name. Well, that, well, that's not what the, the name that Cliff gave him. So she just named him that? That's the reason why he has the cross on his belly, because that's where he got shot and she stitched him up. Oh. Oh my god, what is happening? Well, it makes- it just- it, this game is just coming along now. It all just makes sense. And that's why Bridget raises Sam as her own, because... Because she saved him. Oh, that's Cliff. Oh. You want to go home? Let's go home. So he was the first BB, and then okay. he gets taken out of the pod. Like you weren't supposed to. I know the way. Oh. 
Oh, that's why she puts Sam in the water to bring him back to life and make him... And, and he becomes a repatriate because of that. Now that makes so much sense, because Cliff wasn't a repatriate, but Sam is, because she made him that way. By saving him, she basically made him a repatriate and everything, in the way he is. Oh. Oh, there's a little astronaut. <sighs> Whoa. Oh. What? Are you back as a baby again? Oh, this is after that we got the stitch. Oh, there's Bridget. There you are. Welcome back. You understand his days as a baby are over now that his connection to the other side has been severed. It was me who cut the cord. So, yes. A deathless repatriate in the world of the living. Should we decommission? In a manner of speaking, take him out of the pot. Him as my okay, that makes sense. And that's how he became Sam Bridges. So he was the BB memory that we were seeing. <gasps> yeah! He took Lou out of the pod as well. We well, wasn't supposed to do that. Come on, Lou. Oh. Wake up. Are they dead? Come on, Lou, wake up. <gasps> no. Oh, no, I'm gonna cry. Oh, he's actually crying. <sighs> Come on, Lou, wake up. so sad. No. <laughs> yes! They're still alive, yes. Ew. Oh. <laughs> they they had the little kipu thing. Oh. There's little BT babies. What? This game is beautiful, oh my god. Oh. Wait, why is Sam out in the time fall? He's not wearing a hood. What is happening?
Why are they... The time fall is hitting them, though. Is it not a time fall anymore? Is it just normal rain now? <sighs> oh my god, this game is beautiful. So it's just not time fall anymore? It's just normal rain? That's confusing. I don't know what's happening. Oh, yes. Oh my god. Thank you. Dude. This game has been amazing. I wish that it would go on forever. I really wish it would. Um, I think that the 15th chapter is like just the thing that it's kind of like a... It's kind of like a new game plus that we're just going to spawn in and then it's going to be like we can just go wherever we want, I kind of think. Because I, I heard about that, that, that chapter 15 is kind of like the end, basically the end of the game, but it's like a new game plus kind of thing where you can just go deliver packages and do whatever you want on the place. So it kind of descends here. So, yeah. Um, oh, I just love this series. It was so amazing to record and experience it with you guys. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. If you liked the video, make sure to hit like button and hit subscribe button below because it will help me out. And until then, I will see you guys in the next video. There's some other series that I might do. I might, I'm thinking about maybe doing um, maybe like Spider-Man 2018 because I can. I might play that because I always wanted to play that game. And I played spider Miles Morales and I was saying I wanted to play that game. So I might just play that and we'll just have that. So, yeah. <laughs> uh, I don't even know what else to say, but this game was amazing. Like, everything in here was perfectly made, and if you want to get this game, just go ahead, because it was amazing. And that BB theme song, I am 100% going to get that song on my phone. Yeah, I'm going to. Okay, guys, bye-bye for now. I hope you enjoyed it. Bye, guys.